Hi, Tim here from Geraldo Sleuths, uh, here with uh, another reading update that's uh, a little past you, I think, but I'm also uh, going to be announcing the books that were chosen for next month's uh, read of ones uh, at, the, at the end of the video, but uh, first, uh, first of all, let me start uh, showing the books for uh, you know, for this month's read along. First one is Cain and Abel. It's pretty much a historical fiction starting in the early 1900s. It's I'm around uh, close to a third of the way done and it, it's about uh, two boys, one born in Boston, one born in Poland. Uh, that turn, uh, in 1908, they were born on the same or same day, and uh, it's just following them along. Uh, in, uh, like it uh, went through World War One and uh, the 1920s, and then the stock market crash. Now it's in the 1930s, uh, like with the depression and stuff. And, and it is interesting. There is action in it. Okay, the next one is uh, Fear by Jeff Abbott. It's about a pharmaceutical uh, company, that, or not even a pharmaceutical company, a company that that's developed a drug to uh, treat uh, PTSD, but it, it, which works a lot better than any that they have so far. and. Uh, Pretty much like a cure for PTSD, but uh, they're, they developed it illegally in the United States and they're testing it, but they're keeping it secret from the FDA because they want to just, uh, put it up for bids by the highest bidding pharmaceutical company. And, uh, and then uh, the Next one I'm reading is Split Second. I'm almost, uh, I, I'm almost uh, two thirds of the way done with this one. Also, uh, I was, I was, uh, was wrong with in the last time I talked about it. it it's about the first in the Sean King and Michelle Maxwell series, both the former, uh, or, uh, well, Michelle oh, still works for the for Secret Service that uh, Sean is an ex-agent uh, because uh, he was uh, supposed to protect uh, a former presidential candidate that this was like eight years, happened like eight years before this uh, incident but uh, so and his job was pretty much over with the uh, uh, Secret Service but then uh, and he was a lawyer, and then one morning he walks into his uh, uh, office, law office, and uh, that he would, thought maybe his partner was already in, and he uh, tra not tried opening the door, it was hard, but then when he got it open, discovered a, a dead body of uh, of somebody, uh, uh, somebody that worked for them that was in the uh, witness protection program, and uh, and it, everything's pointing to him as a person that uh, murdered uh, him. Uh, uh, so he's trying to solve that. At, well, at the same time, uh, Michelle Maxwell, the uh, Secret Service agent. Uh, she was uh, protecting a presidential candidate, a current one, that's been kidnapped. So she comes to uh, Sean Maxwell to help her find him, and uh, and it looks like their crimes might be related. Well, I don't want to do any more. I don't want to uh, spoil it for anybody. That one. And then uh, the last one I'm reading is uh, Flight of the Old Dog by Dale Brown. It's about uh, 
revamped uh, B-52 that was revamped in Dreamland in uh, by NOAA's Air, Air Force Base uh, in Las Vegas. It was not really on the base, but on another site that's uh, overseen by NOAA's and uh, uh, this is a super secret uh, B-52 and uh, this is the uh, first book in the Patrick McClanahan series and Patrick McClanahan is considered to be the best uh, uh, navigator in the uh, navigator slash bombardier in the uh, uh, strategic air command and he's brought on to uh, help test uh, the aircraft and uh, and that's all I'm going to get into on this one. I guess I'm about a little over halfway done with this one also. Now, now for the uh, books that have been selected for July by members, there were only two members that voted on it. I gave them people a week to vote on it and uh, have both and uh, all these books were voted on by both of them. First up is Our Game by uh, David Baldacci. It's a uh, second book in the Sean King and Michelle Maxwell series. Next one is uh, Assumed Identity by David Morrell. This is a thriller by him, pretty much I, I guess by or espionage thriller. This is more of that type of uh, but there's usually a love interest in them too, so I'm not sure with this one. Next up, uh, we decided to, uh, I decided to make it so to you try having a book written by a woman each month as long as I have enough books for that. First one to select it is for other children by Mary Higgins Clark. And tap. Uh, this one is the uh, suspense by her. I'm not really sure what it's uh, about. And then they voted not for just one book by a woman author. They voted for, for two. The second one is Dark Horse by Tammy Hold. And I know there are sources involved, involved in this one. This one's a thriller or police procedural or something like that. Or like, like a mystery thriller. Well, that's all I have for this time. If you have any uh, uh, thoughts or questions, just post them down below. I'll leave a link to my uh, 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 leave a link below to my uh, to the my Goodreads group also. So until next time, take it easy and keep on reading.